you know, I honestly don't think I've appreciated a weekend as much as this in ages. So we're just going to have a little talky vlog today because, well, to be honest, this week I didn't do all that much. I did a full week at work, which is kind of weird because the way my job works, because it's a zero hour contract, I can kind of have shifts that are all over the place. So sometimes I won't have a weekend and then sometimes I'll work a full week. So I did that this week. So I really appreciate my weekend and I'm doing it again next week. So it's, it's, it's quite nice to feel like I've got a normal job. Even though I have got a normal job, it's just the hours are a bit funny. Anyway, yeah, not much else has really been going on. I've got awful, awful hay fever and I'm constantly bunged up, so my voice just sounds strange all the time and it's very annoying. Something that I have been working on, because I have got a job now and I've got a bit of extra money, I'm trying to upgrade certain bits of my setup, so eventually it will involve getting a new camera. My mic is perfect, that's exactly what I need. And then a few other bits that I'm currently working on are my actual recording equipment for when I'm doing like let's plays and things like that. I'll show you a couple of bits that I've been picking up. So this is just going to be something that pleases me but a lot of people really wouldn't care. Um, just HDMI leads. These are quite short ones because if you've seen my setup at all you'll know that there's so many cables. There's three different input devices going to two different monitors and it's all kind of contained in one desk basically so I need little short cables like this and the advantage of these as well is they do 4k so my PlayStation which is the PlayStation Pro can do 4k so these are pretty much necessary for that which is good even though I don't have a 4k monitor yet which is something I'm looking at getting in the future they're very expensive at the minute so yeah I'm gonna have to save or wait We'll see. But those are actually, they have a purpose. Obviously they have a purpose, but a purpose with something else I've bought, which is a brand new splitter, switcher, whatever you want to call it. So my setup is, it's quite complex. As I said, there's three different inputs going into two monitors and the two monitors are joined. So they show the same thing. And basically what this does is, I'm not sure if you'll be able to see that. It's got four HDMI ports. This one is the output and these three are all inputs. So I can have the Xbox, the PC and the PlayStation all going in to one monitor which is perfect. And then the reason I got a new one of these, I had one before, this one's a powered one. The one I had before didn't need power. Um, it's because this one does 4K. So basically all my upgrades are making it so all my stuff will work with 4K which is something I, I pretty desperately need. Even though I haven't got a 4K monitor yet but it, it makes sense, it makes sense. Oh, and that comes with, like, a remote. Unlike my other one, it had a button on top. That one has got a button on top, but this one has a remote, so it does wireless as well, which is kind of handy. And now this is something I, I kind of, yeah, I probably shouldn't have bought yet, but I, I really wanted it and I had the money for it, so. It's a brand new capture card. And this is something I've been wanting to get for a while. I've been looking at it for probably near on a year and they released a brand new model of it quite recently. So basically what this is, is I have a version of it already at my computer. I'll show you what it looks like now. And this is just the new version of that. Except this does something a bit more interesting. As you can see in my current setup, we have this box on top, which does live streaming. And then this one underneath, which records everything. This beauty does both so it's an all-in-one package and oh the packaging on this I, I absolutely love nice packaging and it's, it's quite an interesting design as well as you can see it's like a, a triangle so this is let's get it out there we go so this is all it is and it's quite an interesting shape and um, I, I don't know I just kind of really like that and the good thing about this is I was always recording to an external hard drive and it, it's it's a good way of doing it but it can be a bit bulky sometimes what this has right here is an SD card slot and it came with a 128 gigabyte SD card. So, yeah, that's pretty, 
bloody good. And in fact, I'm probably going to put this in my drone and then give the 64 gig to this because I don't need 128 gigs for this. But yeah, that'll be really nice in the drone. But this is this has got some really cool features that I've been wanting for a while. And it does live stream and then it records and it's perfect. I love this little thing. That's really it for the new setup. When I move into a new house, which I haven't actually said this yet, I'm moving in on Friday, on Saturday technically, but I get the keys on Friday. So it's gonna be a completely new setup and I'm gonna to have to redo everything, which is why I'm getting this new stuff, because I'm gonna just improve what I've got. And yeah, I'm really looking forward to moving into the new place. I'm gonna get a better desk. I've got these two black desks at the minute. The one that my current setup is on is a desk that came in the flat I'm currently living in. But when I go to the new house, I'm gonna actually do some kind of proper desk. I'm not sure if I'm gonna make one, which I, I actually probably think I will because AD and Ruby are moving in as well. And Ruby is really good at making stuff. Like she made a, she made a double bed and I'm like, I don't know how she did it, but yeah, she did. And I'm gonna make a desk basically because my room is a bit of an awkward shape. So I want a desk that can make the most of the space and have enough space for all of my stuff on it. So I, I feel like just, getting a big bit of wood from B&Q and making something is the way to go there. Apart from that, not really much else going on. The past week didn't particularly do all that much. I've been playing a lot of PS4 games. I'm trying to catch up on some of the old exclusives. Like I've played Uncharted 1 and Uncharted 2 and I'm currently about halfway through Uncharted 3 at the minute. I'm really enjoying that. After that, I'm gonna go on to Uncharted 4, Until Dawn, Infamous, uh, The Last of Us I'm really looking forward to. And, ooh, there was one more, what was it? I can't remember. Oh, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. I haven't even touched that yet. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to getting to play some of them. And it's nice to just be able to play sometimes for fun because a lot of the time when I'm playing on my Xbox especially, it's because I'm doing it for the channel and it feels like work. Whereas the PlayStation, I don't really use for the channel. It's more for me. And it's just nice to be able to play and have fun. But it does mean I've been procrastinating pretty bad. I have a freelance job that's due in on Tuesday that I really need to start. And it's currently five o'clock on Sunday and I haven't started it yet. It will only take like a couple of hours to do once I get going, but it's just the thought of getting going that's getting me at the minute, so I should probably stop vlogging and go and do it. I hope you enjoyed this. Been a bit talky, been a bit ranty. I quite, I quite like just doing that though. I'll see you next week.